Streamline Back Shop Services presents our latest installment of our how-to series. Today we are going to demonstrate a three-point speed match on a pair of Kato SD40-2 locomotives that have been fitted with TCS K1 D4 decoders. We're going to do our match today using the AccuTrek model railroad speedometer from Model Railroad Technologies. The AccuTrack features an on-off switch, uh, a scale setting for HO and N scale, and a digital readout. The device is a standalone device with all the electronics housed inside of the uh, project box. Uh, it's battery powered and features a an auto shut off uh, to save battery life when it uh, sits idle for an extended period of time. Uh, Three-point speed matching is pretty straightforward. It consists of adjusting CVs 2, 5, and 6, which are the low voltage, the high voltage, and the mid-range voltage, respectively, so that across the, the spectrum of speed steps, uh, the locomotives will perform at a fairly close speed that won't be perfect, but uh, generally is close enough that it doesn't... Uh, produce a lot of bucking and obvious uh, mismatch speed between the locomotives. The alternative method is to do a 28 point uh, speed match using the speed table which are CVs 66 to 94 um, but as you can imagine that's also about uh, what eight times the amount of time so <laughs> Uh, to keep the demonstration brief, um, we're going to do this. Uh, we're going to do a three-point match. Our uh, command station is a uh, MRC Prodigy, uh, and the only other thing we've done here is we've made a simple uh, graph uh, to help us keep track of where we're at. Um, with each of the locomotives. We've already pre-measured them out at uh, a couple of different speed steps. Uh, we're going to target today speed step 28 um, to be set at 70 mile an hour which is the top speed of uh, the locomotive on the real world and uh, the maximum speed on most railroads. So. So well, the, to start with, we'll, uh, the basic process goes, um, warm your locomotives up for about 20 minutes, just running them, uh, you know, pick a good speed and, and let them cycle for quite a while to get them hot. And then run both locomotives through Uh, at speed step one to determine which one of the two are uh, the fastest at the slowest speed. You can speed up a locomotive but you can't slow one down easily. The default settings for uh, most decoders are zero for speed steps two, five, and or, sorry for CVs two, five, and six. Uh, we preset this to a value of 1 at speed step 1, 41 at speed step 14, or I'm sorry, uh, CV6 at 41 and 74 for CV5. And that produces thirty mile an hour at speed step fourteen.
and about 73 at speed step 28. So. We'll swap our locomotives. You know, we would adjust the voltage of the first one uh, up just a little bit but on a three-point match to get within uh, 0.8 mile per hour is going to be pretty tough so uh, we're going to leave it where it is for right now um, so now we need to target seventy three mile an hour at speed step twenty eight we're at 71, which is probably pretty close. Again, if we wanted to get that a little tighter, we could try and do it on a 28-point uh, match. We'd adjust CV5. to match our top speeds and then now that we've got our top speed set where we want it we'll check our mid-range speed again we're at 30 so these two locomotives uh, are matching out within a, a one mile per hour at all speed ranges the last step of the process then is we will just uh, run the pair of them on a piece of track together to make sure that they are fairly close. As I mentioned the 28 point match will get them uh, much closer but at speed step 28 full speed and, and all the way through the range they haven't changed uh, maybe two inches through the whole process. So. depending upon various conditions of the track as they go around. Uh, a pair of locomotives will never run absolutely perfectly with each other, but as you can see, a 10-minute uh, process using the uh, Model Railroad Technologies AccuTrack um, has gotten our locomotives to where they'll run uh, extremely well together in a, a consist, um, very quick and very painless. The AccuTrack Model Railroad Speedometer from Model Railroad Technologies, available from Streamline Back Shop Services. Come visit us at sbsfordcc.com for all your DCC needs.